What was the way out? Alright guys, welcome back to the Planet Crafter episode 3 guys. Episode 3 today. Well, we had two options today. <laughs> and I choose the one that includes building a, a new base. So, I, I don't know, it might be rash, because we might get other building parts, uh, but I have a, a, an idea for a simple yet uh, shiny looking base, instead of this snake-like thing that we have here. So, uh, but I just need to know, or I just need to figure out where I want to put it. I mean, we could pare this down and put it here, but I don't think that's the greatest idea, uh, because... Uh, well, because, uh, you know, it's tricky to build over there. And we're going to have to also find out, or figure out, sorry, how these uh, platforms work. These uh, foundations, right? So, uh, so that's, that's what we're doing today. Uh, the other thing we are working towards, of course, is the blue sky. We could reach that as well. That's... Uh, that would be great. We could build our base here, I suppose. So I have been doing a light, tiny little bit off camera. I, d I don't want to really uh, play off camera in the series, but uh, I have done a tiny bit. I've just added crates and I've uh, gathered a few materials. I've even organized ourselves now so that we have then ice and cobalt here. Just, just we have iron and magnesium here. Of course, this didn't last long, as you'll see. Um, we have silicon and titanium here. Uh, we have other stuff here like iridium and things like that. And then it sort of broke down because I needed more space for iron. I love this game though. It's really good. Simple, you know, to get into. It's but it's really, uh, really quite nice to play. You know, this is an open area, so we could. Like I don't know how this works, so we're gonna have to do some experiments. So we could put this here. Can we then put something there? It doesn't look like it, right? So, we, because this is higher, we need to sort of put the, the tallest bit here, right? We'll just, you know, have a fiddle around and see what happens. See, then I can't put that here. Why can I not put this here? Maybe we need to start from the bottom. It doesn't look foundationally sound when it stands like that, you know? That irritates me. So, this game has great atmosphere and all that lot, but I have some problems maybe with uh, the way building works. And now our oxygen is low again. I mean, I have 200 oxygen. It's not critical by any stretch of the imagination, honestly. My computer is a wuss. I mean, that is totally floating. And now I can oh okay. Oh maybe well, you know what guys? Maybe it is because there's ores there. I don't think they affected it. Let's try and remove that. Oh yeah, okay, 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 okay. It still looks like it's floating to me. <laughs> Over in that corner there. Uh, but I guess we have to overlook that. So my plan here is to make quite a simple grid here. Three by three. And that's where up there is where we're gonna live. And uh, on top of it, we're gonna have a shiny house, right? With uh, with features. Yeah, I mean, uh... no. You know what? I think we need to take all this down. It, it cannot float like that. That is just not okay. That's not okay, guys. Oxygen tank hit tier three. We're building that straight away. This is a great upgrade for us. We also have the backpack tier 3, right? That we haven't built. The backpack, this is gonna be funny. Aha! See, I learned things. Look at this big inventory. But yeah, I think uh, maybe, maybe I was, uh, maybe that was the thing. Maybe it's the, like the, the rocks and that. In that case, I would like to have it a bit lower, right? Let's try it. No, no, it's not that. Oh no, it is that. Okay. Cool. Uh, so.
So what is the problem with building that? Oh no, there is no problem. Just finicky. Yeah, so they, I mean, this is early access game. I think they need to work on this a bit, to be honest. Building. Look at Valheim. Valheim has a good building system. That's cool that it now sort of sits properly in the sand here, right? Alright, so what we need here is uh, three, uh, or well, we need uh, some living compartment here, basically. Oh, nice, it goes outside of it there. I don't know if I put that in the middle. All right, let's see here. So we can build that there, and that's now floating, which I don't really like. <clears throat> so these platforms aren't as big as uh, as these things. Anyway, we'll keep building and we'll fix like the uh, the uh, physics later. You you're not telling me now, okay? Right, if I put it there... Okay, this is actually the first time I'm a little bit annoyed with this game. Trying to build your base is not that much uh, fun. It could be funner. Also, I have been thinking now for three episodes, what is with this door? How can we get oxygen in here? There's an open door. Right, so I think what we need to do then is we need to expand the foundation a bit. In all, uh, in two directions anyway, right? So like this way. Yeah, like that. Okay, and then if we build... We'll start, we'll start in this corner here, because this seems to be the problem corner. <laughs> okay, so like that, right? Hey, it's got a shiny window too, that is awesome. But okay, let's see, let's see if we can chuck these on here. We're on 12,000 terraforming index, which is very good, but it's not nearly good enough. Here I am, having gathered materials. And uh, I used them up in like two seconds. There's no decent, yet anyway, decent storage facilities. Like the chest contains nothing. Why don't we have wall chests with, uh, you know, why can't we stack chests? We could have some shelving, but again guys, early access. I'm sure they're thinking of fixing things like that. This one is fine. We need a round corner over here. That. We're building a circle basically guys, we're building a, like a, well, a, a rounded rectangle. <laughs> and there we have it, and uh, I mean we will have pillars apparently by the looks of it, that's not what I expected, but okay. That looks good. Plunk a door here, and then uh, a stair if we can. So what's the problem with a stair? Okay, that's a bit weird. But okay, let's keep it like that for now. Hey, this is great. Um, so we can have like uh, a desk unit here, a uh, sofa unit here, uh, a bed unit here, and uh, something here. And then uh, we can have like heaters here, and plants here, and storage here, or something like that. I don't know if it's, uh, you know, maybe this isn't big enough, but it's bigger than what we have. Wow, this stair is irritating me though. 
So I'm not allowed to put it there, but I'm allowed to put it there. Okay. Well, you know what? I'm going to redo it again then. Incoming! <laughs> Incoming! Hey, it always seems to come from that direction. Well, I can't say that. It's only been twice now. It's beautiful and horrible at the same time. So let's see if I'm right. Uh, a lot of rocks uh, should now have spawned here. Don't know if that's the case. But it looks awesome, of course. Uh oh. Need to breathe. Okay, I think I'm happier with this. <laughs> you know, I have a stair that actually goes straight in. And yeah, that is the same here. Uh, oh, and another thing, we can actually build a ladder to uh, to the top here as well. We can get roof access, I think. Like this, right? And hey, we're on top here. Uh, trans we're getting stuff now. Let's see here. We got... So we can have uh, glass in the roof. That is sweet. We need to try it out. And we got some new panel and some bits like that as well. And uh, yeah, we can of course have glass in these windows as well, right? Yeah. <laughs> now we're talking. <laughs> I love it. We need to have access to food soon because we're running low in our stores. Well, we're not running low low, but a little bit low. <laughs> we have a skylight. Sweet. Moving here is not quite simple. But the way to do it is to take some stuff down here and then put it up back up again. I think we have a problem. And we have some other screens here. The energy level screen, transmissions and uh, progress. I think of course transmissions is great. And I think, me, I don't know if we have any transmissions. Oh, communication antenna. <clears throat> I dread moving the storage, by the way. That's not gonna be fun. But then we can't see the text, that's just gonna have to be the way it is. Hey, that's not too bad. That looks kind of alright. But why can't I now have a shelf here and another row? We'll plonk one in each corner here. And yeah, we're doing the tier 2 ones now. We might as well upgrade while we're at it, right? Solar panel tier 2. I have never even built tier 1. Let's get up on the roof and plonk that in. Nice. Very cool. Solar power, guys. We can put more of them up here. I'm guessing it's going to be tier 1 for now until we find an aluminium. We're getting desperate here, us guys. We need uh, more aluminium. All right, so we need to uh, get iridium uh, and uh, aluminium. Uh, the heaters look cool in the window, so that's good. I want to go to these caves and see what's going on in, uh, in them. Well, I'm assuming it's caves. That just seems the natural thing. It is some sort of... Oh, there's big old stalagmite, stalactite things here. Uh, it's super precarious, honestly. Woohoo! Iridium! Just laying around. Oh, this is, the, this is the place for Iridium, that's for sure. Right, 
around the bases of these pillars, right? Look at one more. What was the way out? Oh, there's aluminium on the floor as well here. I know we're hungry and stuff. Well, it looks lighter over there, so I think that was the way out. But you know what? Aluminium on the floor. Wow, that is great. And uh, now we can build our food processor, or food uh, grower. Uh, but we don't, of course we need more, right? But it's a great start, and it's good to know, right? Uh, I don't know if the food grower is like a thing that we need to interact with often. But we'll put it there for now and see what happens. That looks like it's wonky. Alright, there we go, and then we put some food in here, I suppose. Uh, squash, or eggplant, or beans. Beans, all the way. And we ran out of power. It's definitely a different type of rock, though, that's for sure. Oh, a bit, um, it's a bit tricksy getting there. I really want jetpack. I hope there's a jetpack in these uh, in this game. Wow. They're certainly cool. Oh, there is aluminium on the floor here. And that is in fact what glimmers and shimmers and glitters. And I guess these are aluminium pillars then as well. Do have oxygen with me, yeah? Do. Very nice. Hey, oh. Fantastic landscape. Quit your nagging ways, computer. Ooh, there's a shipwreck over here as well. Just saw it. Let's go have a little quick look. Wow, I'm getting super sidetracked here. I don't think we can get in it. One of those impenetrable things. And there's wheels, two wheels there. <laughs> oh, and two there. But well, I don't know where I came from now. I'm lost again. I really should use the compass, to be honest. Oh, there's a crate. Doink. Well, we'll take the lot. And we'll deconstruct that so we don't go looking in it again. Stuck in the ravine. I have no clue where I'm at. Alright, alright, alright. 
We're, we're good, we're good. Oh, there's just here as well. Ah, food. Boy, did we need that. We need some lights, honestly. It looks very ominous without lights. Growth, 54%. So it takes a while. Light. Uh, and now we have the opportunity here to build level 2 heaters here instead of these. Let's try and do that. Ha ha ha. And we're up to 40k guys, 40k. And our heat should go up here now. Uh, and I think drills is also a thing we need to increase, right? Because it looks like... Well, I don't know what the numbers mean to be honest. 12.6 PPQ per second. Uh, 9.2 PKs per second and 3.8 NPAs per second. Nano Pascals. Uh, Pico Kelvins and parts per uh, something. <laughs> That's parts per ton, right? So what's PPQ? Don't know. Anyway, guys, I think that's gonna be it for today. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this uh, series. Let me know in the comments, and uh, I will see you next time. Bye.